Hey there everyone, this is Danielle playing some more New Horizons. This time we're going to focus on getting enough uh, Nook Miles to pay off our first loan. We've nearly got enough, so there's just a few more things we've got to do to reach 5,000. Um, I'm going to start by probably making a custom design. I think there's one for that. Yep, first custom design. There you go. I kind of wish it would tell you how much you get for doing it, but, you know, whatever. Uh, so, custom designs, here we go. Let's make one. Uh, change design. Uh, let's see, how much space do we have here? Uh, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. Is that 16? Yes, 16. Okay, so it's 32 by 32. Okay, we want to divide that. Uh, a lot of options here. I wonder if the touch screen works. I would assume yes, but I have no way of knowing. I have a hunch it doesn't because of how these often go. Um, not sure why I have these little stripes and things on it to begin with. I don't want them, so goodbye, little stripes. Ba -ba -da -ba -ba. Oh, that's what that does. Okay. There we go. Uh, no, keep editing. I didn't want to stop. Change tool back to pen. Okay, we're going to need, let's see, uh, a nice light blue. That'll do the trick. Uh... Down. And then a nice pink. Um, I want to change the palette actually. That pink's not quite light enough. Um, let me see, let me see. But you already know what I'm doing. <laughs> Let's see, we want a nice light pink. There, pastel colors, that looks good. Let's give it a try. Yeah, that'll work. There we go. Okay, cool. Um, now we're actually going to switch over and use the rectangle tool to draw this out properly. Uh, it's a little confusing. Just like that? No. I want, I want like a filled rectangle. Is there an option for that? That doesn't look like it. Hmm. Alright, I guess it'll work. Do, do, do. I'll just start like this and then I can use the full bucket in a moment to actually fill it in. Ba -da -boo, ba -da -da -boo. Do the same thing but in pink. Do, 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 do. And then do it again down here. <laughs> There we go, and then we want to go to the fill bucket and fill in these gaps. And switch to blue and fill in these gaps, or cyan, I suppose. There we go. And... Are these all the same width or did I mess something up? Yes, I messed up. The pink ones need to be one wider. <laughs> That's why it doesn't look right. Did it do? It's interesting that it sort of curves the line, even though you're using direct pixels. Like, if you look in the point I'm, I haven't done yet, you can see there's like a slant. It's interesting. There we go. That's what I'm talking about. Done. If I can use a regular keyboard for this. Um... I don't know how many characters I get because it doesn't show you the limits, so I'm just going to try to do it and see if I did it right. Oh my god. I feel like I'm running out of room here, judging from the amount of space it's given me. Really? There's clearly room for more letters there. <laughs> Alright. 
Um, let's just abbreviate it then. A C uh, colon N H. Not sort out online. I'll do. <laughs> and job done. Uh, let's wear it. That's what I'm talking about. <laughs> How much is that worth? 500 miles. That puts us over. We are good to go. Am I now carrying that shirt I was wearing? Yeah, I am. Yeah, cool. Du -du 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 Let's go in here and tell Nook that we've got the amount we needed. Hello, Tom. Ah, Danielle. Hello, hello. What would you like to talk to me about? I'm all ears. Oh, you'd like to pay your moving fees? Very well, you owe 5,000 miles. I'm ready to pay. Thank you so much. Indeed, that is 5,000 miles and not a mile less. With that, your move-in fees have been paid in full. This is a happy day for us both, hmm? Yes, yes, you're free and clear of debt, living on a thriving scenic island. What could be better? Oh, that wasn't actually a rhetorical question. Maybe more specific. How is that tent treating you? It's fine, I guess. Oh, uh -huh, just fine? But consider, doing fine on a formerly deserted island is actually quite good, hmm? Together we're reshaping this barren waste, l I mean pristine paradise, into a lovely community. <laughs> oh dear. <laughs> ah yes, we mustn't rest on our laurels, hmm? Perhaps there is more we could do. Yes, yes, I suppose the time is right to discuss the possibility of building custom homes. Now, there are certain challenges to building fabulous homes in a remote location such as this. Challenges that do translate directly into costs, I'm afraid. Up uh, with zero interest financing and an extremely lax repayment plan, anything is possible. So, Danielle, if you ever find yourself interested in a new home, do come see me. Oh, one more thing to share. We have a Miles Redemption service for the Nook Miles you've collected. When you access the Nook Stop, you'll be able to redeem your Miles for lots of interesting things. You'll be sure to check it out sometime soon, soon hmm? Well, then I hope you continue to enjoy your getaway package life. Did I get Nook Miles for paying off my Nook Miles, because that's kind of funny. I, I did, actually. <laughs> ka -ching. Okay, let's look at the machine. Welcome to Nook Stop. So I should be able to register for Miles Redemption Services. Let's have a look. Redeem Nook Miles. Nook Miles ticket? Miles plus only? I don't know what that means. Customers with home contracts. Okay, so you can't get these things until you have a house. Okay, that makes sense. You can get all this useless stuff already, <laughs> but the things that are worth having, you need to have a house for. Okay, that makes sense. Yeah, you can get Nook, Nook Ink themed clothes if you want them for some reason, but if you want uh, things like the Custom Design Pro Editor, which I think gives you way more options, and the tool ring, which I think is the one, is the thing that lets you switch between tools, like using the up arrow, instead of having to go into the menu or whatever. I want all those things, so I guess I'm going to have to ask for a house. <laughs> oh my goodness. Hey, uh, Mr. Mr. Nook? Uh, about my home? Oh, Danielle! Have you made a decision about home ownership? Ready to move forward into comfort and luxury? As fun as living in a tent can be, a house gives you more space and helps you put down roots. Now, building a house means taking out a new loan to the amount of 98,000 bells. So, what do you think? Ready to build your own, your home, home sweet home? Yeah, let's do it. Thank you for your business. I'll get construction started right away. By the way, you get to choose from eight different colours for the roof. Could you please select a roof colour from this list, hmm? Uh... I would like green. Green, there we go. I'll get that order in for you. Yes, yes. Oh, one more thing. 
Homeowners get an automatic Nook mileage program upgrade. Just give me one moment, hmm? Yes, yes, there we go. Update your program membership details, Danielle. Now when you use the Nook Miles app, you'll have access to all the Nook Miles Plus benefits. Nook Miles Plus includes a nifty way to earn additional miles for special circumstances. We'll see the details when you launch the app, so please give it a look when you can. That is all from me. Your wonderful new home should be ready tomorrow. Quite exciting, yes? And some pretty fast building, I've got to say. Well, it must just be really small. <laughs> Let's look at the Nook Miles app and see what's new. Nook Miles with a plus. Your rank is increased. You can now use Nook Miles Plus services. Nook Miles Plus makes it even easier to earn miles as you go about enjoying island life. There are also special redemption options that only Nook Miles Plus members get. And just amazing opportunity. Okay, so it adds this top menu here. I can press plus. I get DIY projects. Plant flower seeds. Redeem Nook Miles. Sell shells. Capture a memory. Um... I, I guess I want to sell some shells and stuff. Okay, and it tells you how many these are worth as well, which is good. Hmm. I also think I can go to this machine now and it should actually let me access the new stuff. Yep, Nook Mars Plus program. Even more redemption options. Heck yeah. Let's see what this stuff actually costs. It's probably more than I can afford right now. Oh no, I can get a tool ring. Details. Easily swap between favorite tools. Yeah, that's what I want. Uh, tools with excellent durability. What's a Nook Miles ticket? A special tour at the airport. Okay. Uh, I'll wait for that. I'll get the tour ring though. Redeem. Wait 100 miles for tour ring. It's essential. Redeem. Now generating tool ring. It's essential. Your order has been printed. Huh. Okay. I see, this totally makes sense. Oh. I learned how to easily switch tools. When I'm outside, I can press up to use the tool ring now. Oh, I, I get Nook Miles back for doing that, which is nice. Catching. <laughs> That's cool. Um. Dun, 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 dun. Okay, so now if I go outside and... Look at the tool ring by pressing up. Oh yeah, that's really good. Look at that. Very good. That's what I want. <laughs> okay, cool. Uh, da, 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 da. I think... Oh, I see. It's got these things start. I'm guessing I can start other things? Maybe. I don't know. Hmm, I'm still kind of running out of room for stuff here. Maybe I can craft some stuff to free up some space. Um, or I could just go put these outside the leather's tent again because I want to donate them. And the museum's not open yet. Place item. Oh, the dragon beetle's in a bucket. That makes sense. Surgeon fish, place item. There we go. You just stay there. <laughs> There's a bug. Is that another long locust? I can't really tell. I think that's a common butterfly rather than the other kind. That might be worth getting. Ugh. I'm having trouble catching bugs in this game. <laughs> Yes, I caught a common butterfly. They often flutter by. Yeah, so I'm gonna need, I'm gonna need to donate that once the museum exists, which it doesn't yet. Uh, place item. <laughs> oh, I wanted to plant those um peaches. So if I grab my flimsy shovel here, I should be able to find a nice spot to plant an extra tree or two, or even three. Yeah, that'll do. So yeah, you just dig a hole and you can bury a fruit in the hole. Uh, plant one. And that'll grow into a tree in a couple days. Um... <laughs> Ah, 
And there we go. Nook miles are one lot. Uh, what is it? Fruit roots. Planting new varieties. Okay, I see. So there's miles for each variety, I'm guessing. Because I can see there's five different slots there. I wonder if I can plant the one that I already started with and get funds for that. I should also sell some shells because it's telling me to do that. Um, also, capture a memory? That's just take a photograph, right? I can do that. Create a PDA common butterfly. <laughs> I really need somewhere to keep all my crafting materials. Because I'm ending up with a lot, and I don't really have room for all this. <laughs> hmm. Let's just let's make some DIY projects, because that was a way to get more, more Nook Miles. So yeah, it's clear the Nook Miles system is much more important than the Meow Coupon system in the previous game. Um, since you absolutely need to get Nook Miles to pay off that first loan instead of normal money. Which is kind of weird, but, you know, whatever. Well, I can make a DIY workbench. Let's make one and put it in my house, I reckon. Uh, what else? Do -do, do -do. I haven't made a watering can yet. I don't know how much more room I have in my inventory. Um, but if I can, I can probably make a couple more leaf umbrellas and then sell them. To free up a bit more space. And also make a little bit of money, because, yeah. Leaf umbrellas sell for twice as much as the weeds they're made of. It's pretty great. It doesn't tell you in this menu, like how much stuff is in your pockets for some reason. I feel like it probably should. Yeah, my pockets are too full. And it doesn't, it does let me try again, even though there isn't room to do so, which is a bit silly. Okay. Leaf umbrella, leaf umbrella, leaf umbrella. Um, I'll put that workbench in at home and yeah, so these three umbrellas. They don't sell for very much, but you can see it's, it's twice as much as if you sold the same amount in the weeds without crafting them. Plus, you know, I get the Nook Miles for doing the crafting, which is nice. Catching. Uh, what is that? Flower seeds. Sell shells. Capture a memory. Do -do 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 -do. I should probably talk to the others. Talk to the others. I haven't done that much, and they might have recipes and stuff. Um, and that's a major part of this game. Like, this is this is a series about interacting with the other villagers in your town. Uh, I'll put my workbench in here first, so I've got a bit more room, but then I will go ahead and do that. No, not that. This one. Um, is it bigger than it looks? Is it, like, multiple spaces? Uh, I can't see how big it is, because it won't actually put it out. I'm guessing it's, like, real big. Yeah, it takes up that much space. Alright, um... If I put it, hmm, let's see, if I push this, this way, into the corner like that, there'll be room over here for the workbench. There we go, and then I can put this other stuff over here. Yeah, the tent is really, really small, which is why you want to upgrade to a house as soon as possible. <laughs> but yeah, I can use this workbench to build stuff in my house, right? Yeah. Cool. And yeah, I can build, looks like, all the same sort of stuff, so that's useful. Uh, it doesn't really matter, because you can just go to the other crafting table that's pretty close, but I, I guess in the long run it might be handy to have the option to go somewhere else and craft. Uh, let's go talk to the villagers. Over there, there we go. That's bladders. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. 
I don't know where anyone is. <laughs> Are they in their houses? Looks like no one's here. Nope. Hmm. Oh, hello, what's that? Did I find a message in a bottle? I did. Open. To someone on an island out there, sometimes good ideas come from unexpected places. I came up with a new way of crafting a mirror that I hope works just as well for you. Whoever and wherever you are, we can all use some quiet reflection. Best wishes, Ellie. I got a recipe. Let's read it. Huh, okay. Sweet, I learned a DIY recipe for a wooden full-length mirror. Sounds good. Uh, giant clam, yeah. Give me that. <laughs> Oh, there's a villager. Hello, friend. Oh, look at those porbs. Do you see the porbs? Little beans? Yo, how are you, Groof? Let's chat. Hey, isn't that the hat I gave you? Looks great. Really shows off your head muscle, Groof. Alright, I thought you might give me something, but yeah, thanks for the hat. It's, it's nice. It's a nice hat. Uh, I guess I'll grab a few more shells and then sell them. Since the game encouraged me to do that. That's a full inventory. No, it's not. But I might talk to Diva and see if she has something to offer. Diva, you got to actually cast your line into the water. Sup, you know? Where you headed? I want to chat. Hey, how'd you sleep last night? This island's so quiet at night, it's almost weird, you know? I mean, don't get me wrong, I slept like a log. But I wouldn't mind some more action around here. Oh, that's cute. <laughs> <laughs> I'd like to sell some stuff to Timmy here. Uh, these three shells, I suppose. Mm, I might need this other stuff, so yeah. Sounds good. Um, can I buy anything from you at this point? I have a decent amount of money. I might be able to buy something good. Let's see. Picnic basket. Handy water cooler. Uh, you can still make slingshots. Oh, maybe I can buy a slingshot recipe or something. I can. I wonder if I want to. Hmm. Hmm. I'm not sure if I want to buy the slingshot recipe or not, because they're selling the axe recipe there, which I already ha know, so maybe there's another way to get it? Hmm. Let's have a look in here. Pretty good tools, recipes. Custom design pro editor. You can buy more hairstyles and stuff, yeah. Hmm, I'm not sure. Let's make that mirror, uh, if I can. I think I can probably make one. Yes. I need one iron nugget, which I have, and five wood, which I have. Let's make a mirror. I made a wooden full-length mirror. All done for now. Um, cool. <laughs> Let's give it a try. Let's install it in our tent and see how we look in the mirror. Well, I can't see me in the mirror. I'm not sure what's happening. Did you examine it? Should I change up my look with this wooden full length mirror? Yeah? Oh, okay, that's how you get to this menu. Okay. It's got more options than it used to, which is cool. Um, let me see. <laughs> Slightly more options. I'm guessing it'll expand some more as I buy more stuff. Uh, there aren't more colours for the hair yet, but maybe that unlocks as well. Paste paint. Yeah, I can leave that the way it is. Cool, okay, so that's what mirrors do. Pretty much what they do in Dragon Quest Builders too, so fair enough. <laughs> uh, okay, um, 
let's let's grab uh, another five shells and sell them because there is a nook points goal for doing that or nook miles whatever it's called do 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 and I think there's some stuff there that I do want, so probably a good idea to collect the implements required to get it. <laughs> uh, hey Blathers, I don't know how to wake you up yet, sorry. Maybe I can try some of the tools I do have? Uh, if I hit you with my net. Hmm, no, I must need something else that I don't have yet. <laughs> Vaulting poles are great. It's adorable. I can see little geysers. Is that like a bug or something? We need to dig where the geyser is? Hmm. Like, no, a bug like, you know, a, a... Oh, there we go. We got something. A manila clam. Fishing bait. Oh, hello. Interesting. Oh no, I don't have a slingshot. Oh no, there's a present. I don't have a slingshot. Oh no, I can't get it. <laughs> uh, we'll have to come back to that. We'll probably miss this one. It'll probably be gone by the time we get a slingshot. Okay, the clams don't stack. Hmm. I'm a little confused about how that works, and I also wish I had a slingshot already, which I don't. <laughs> Vault. I know I can just buy a slingshot from Timmy, but I can also buy a slingshot recipe. And they also give me recipes for free a lot of the time, so... I'm not really sure what to make of this. Um, let me just see what the new crafting thing I had an idea for is, if it's showing up. Oh, fish bait, there we go. Okay, so you make it out of a clam. And I guess that makes fishing better somehow? I don't know. Hmm. Let me just sell these other shells to free up some space. make two, so let's make another one. Let's see what they do. Hmm. I guess I'll try to go fishing now I have some fish bait and see what happens? I, I don't know. I don't know what it does. Looking for fish in the water. There's one. Um. Well, I got a boot. <laughs> I could probably wear this if I found another boot, right? I've got an idea for a DIY recipe. Is it to, to, to wear the boots? Is that the recipe? <laughs> Yeah, boots are a thing you could fish up in previous games, but you never wanted to. They were just garbage. So, the idea that you can repurpose them as clothing is pretty cool. Oh, I got a can. An empty can. You're supposed to catch the fish before you can it. 
This empty can can be repurposed. I've got no idea for a DIY recipe. Okay, so you get to recycle all the garbage from previous games. That's pretty cool. Um, do I need to equip the fish bait or something? Oh, I can scatter food. Okay, well, let's give it a try. Um, I do have some inventory slots, so if I do catch a fish, that's alright. Let's just give it a quick shot, see what happens. Scatter food. Okay, so you throw it into the water and- oh, I see, it makes a fish appear. Yeah, that makes sense. That's where fish come from. Fish are generated by fish bait, just like in real life. You give them a clam and they go, whoa. Do, 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 do. Look at my lure. Ah, dang it. <laughs> I got startled. Uh, do, 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 do. Uh, let's go back home and have a look at these recipes that I've apparently found. I guess I could put the crafting table outside too. Like, in this game you can put all the furniture outside, so it doesn't need to take up space. Which is nice. Let's craft. Okay, let's see. Uh, I can make recycled boots out of two boots. I can make a succulent plant out of a clump of weeds in an empty can. Oh, that's, that's so adorable, I love it. Let's repurpose. I have enough boots in order to wear them, but I can make a succulent plant. And I just did, so that's cool. Uh... There isn't really room to decorate here yet. <laughs> I'll put it outside. Because you can do that now. Just over here. Mm, it's a little fiddly placing stuff. I don't know if there'll be like a Nook Miles upgrade that makes that less fiddly. Because that would be that would be good. Okay, it won't go any further that way, so I'll just leave it there. I'll do. Push! <laughs> the vaulting ball is great. In the previous games, you just had a bridge across all the rivers at the start, and you could place extra bridges later in the game to make it a bit easier, but in this one you don't have to worry about bridges, you can just do that. That's pretty cool. Uh, hello fish. I see you out there. Uh, I am just not used to this. <laughs> Just grab that. How am I doing space-wise? Oh, that's stacking up, so it's not taking up any space. Cool. Oh, what is that? Yes! I caught a horse mackerel! Of course, mackerel. Oh! Oh no! Thank you for your service, faithful flimsy fishing rod. Yeah, I was gonna break eventually. I was expecting that. Aiming for that spot. There we go. I'll try selling some of these clams as well, see if they're worth selling. I wonder how I get up there. I assume we'll be able to eventually, but... I don't know if you get like a jetpack or something to climb the cliff. <laughs> That'd be pretty cool. But I mean, there's clearly a bunch of stuff up there, so there must be a way to reach it eventually in the game. I wonder if the vaulting pole is considered flimsy as well, because it's not called a flimsy vaulting pole. Maybe it just lasts forever. That would be helpful. Since then I wouldn't be able to get stuck without a vaulting pole. 
Oh no, I meant to sell stuff. Hang on. Hello. Okay, I wanna sell... I wanna sell you some shells. Boop, boop. Uh, yeah, and I'll put the horse mackerel outside the museum tent. Sold. Is that enough shells yet? There we go. I just sell ten shells. Alright. Catching. <laughs> okay, then I want to plant flower seeds and capture a memory. Because, yeah, I already have both of these, so it's possible that recipe will also be provided in another way. Hmm. Hmm, I don't know. Yeah, I'll buy it. It's not expensive. I can get 300 bells back very easily. And I can make a slingshot with it. Huh, okay. Sweet, I wanted to do DIY recipe for a slingshot. Let's go make one. Let's craft. Okay, it's made of hard wood, apparently. I made a slingshot. Do I get... I got a something. Um, oh, for, for selling seashells? By the seashore? Okay. Cool. Oh, and for buying something? Yeah, I got some miles for that too. Thank you. <laughs> bell ringer? Spending your bells on the island helps revitalize the local economy. Yes, yes. Okay. Okay, cool. So the slingshot, you just, yeah, you shoot into the air with it, and you can hit things like flying presents, which got away from me earlier. Oh yeah, I need a new fishing rod. Forgot about that. Hmm. Let's put the horse mackerel at the front of this place first. <laughs> Check out my cool horse mackerel, y'all. <laughs> hmm, um... Looks like there's room. Is it just really big, or...? No, it's normal size. You just didn't want to go there. Must have been too close. I should make a new fishing rod. <laughs> I don't know. I, I'm discouraged from fishing and bug catching too much because the museum won't take any donations yet, so it's annoying to have to do something else with them. Like, put them out the front of the museum tent. It's better than in the previous games where you just couldn't really store them anywhere, but, you know, it's still not great. Uh, anyway, new fishing rod. Uh... I'm going to need more tree branches, because I've used up all of them. <laughs> hey, Teddy. Let's talk. This place gets me so pumped. The breeze, the crashing waves, nature all around us. It's all awesome. I just want to jog laps around the island and catch bugs and fish and lift and lift and lift, Groof. Yeah, sounds good. <laughs> oh, tree branch, cool. Thank you, tree branch. It's good to have your net out because if uh, a wasp falls out, you'll be able to catch it straight away. I 
I think in some of the older games you couldn't shake trees while holding a net, but in this one you can. You could in New Leaf as well, but that might have been only in the updated version. I'm not sure. Tree branch. Money. What's all this money doing in trees anyway? Hello, beetle. What is that? Yes, I caught an earth-boring dung beetle. It's not boring at all. Oh, oh. That's it for my flimsy net. Tools break real fast in this game. <laughs> it's alright. It's not a problem, really. I don't mind making new stuff when I need to. Place item. Boop. Hmm. Hmm, let's get into a more uh iconic pose <laughs> for taking our first photograph. Let's let's go over onto this island, I reckon. We can stand here under this lovely tree. I'll do. Hmm, lots of filter options, yep. Uh, dramatic, yeah. Soon. <laughs> Boop. <laughs> Give me them miles, yeah. <laughs> oh my goodness. I think there was also a normal one. Yeah, shot a bug. Catching. Uh, I want to update my profiles. Nook miles for miles. Earning nook miles for earning nook miles. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my goodness, that's so meta. Uh. Vault. I do want to look at my uh, passport app here and see if I can put something else in here. Passport photo? There we go. <laughs> and comment. There we go, perfect. <laughs> uh, there it is, edit credit. Claims, probably only like 100? Oh, 300, okay. That's not bad. It's not bad. 
Um, cool. I think I'm getting a little stuck on what to do next again. Uh, I'll try planting the cherries. I think that might count as another fruit, another fruit, no, cherries are the native fruit. Uh, it'd be nice, be nice to have another cherry tree as well anyway, even though there's plenty. It's always good to have more. Yeah, that's what I thought. That was down the bottom here. Nope, no, it was higher up. There it is, fruit roots. It should jump directly to the one that you can get miles for. I don't know why it doesn't do that. There we go. Catching. Hi, Deva. Wow, my heart's really racing. I hope the fish can't hear it. Cute. Um, babe, you've got to put your actual, like, line into the water to catch a fish. Uh, she'll figure it out. Hmm. <laughs> I'm not used to the vibration when it, when it bites, because it doesn't happen in Pocket Camp when you leave. <sighs> Gotta get used to that. Otherwise I won't be able to catch anything. Um, how are we doing? We're doing alright. Um... I do want to expand my storage, because I seem to be running out of space already. Um, I don't know what options let me do that. I think there's an option in here that gives you more storage. This one, Pocket Organization Guide. More items, yeah. Uh, and then those give you different hair colours and stuff, but... Uh, yeah, I want the Pocket Organization Guide, which costs 5,000. That'll take a while. We can also get better tools, apparently, which sounds good too. Uh, if I go to Nook Shopping, what does that do? Is that... Oh, it's the catalogue of items I already have, I think. Or well, maybe not? Hang on, I don't, I don't have any of these. Huh. I don't need glasses. Delivered... Okay, cool. Huh. I assume that would be the catalogue for buying items you've already had, which has been a thing in previous games, but it's, apparently it's not that. Apparently it's something different. Um, I guess I'll buy the DIY recipes thing here as well, or whatever it was, DIY for beginners. So I don't think I have that one. I'd like to know what recipes are in it, but it won't tell me, so I'll just buy it. Uh, let's see what we got, I guess. Um, new recipes. Okay, so we can make an ocarina, which is arena, which is cool. We can make some wooden blocks. We can make an old-fashioned wash tub. And a stone stool, and a frying pan, and a hay bed. I wonder how much a hay bed sells for, because that's using up weeds a lot faster than the umbrellas. Let's find out. Let's make a hay bed and see how much it's worth. I mean, it's a bit faster. Like, it's 20 instead of 15, but it is faster. Let's make another hay bed. Now, I don't think I want to sleep on that instead of the bed I already have at home, but I can make some and see what they're worth. <laughs> uh, hay bed, hay bed, and the clam. Yep. Nine hundred. I think that's about the same. We think twenty, maybe two hundred, four hundred. I don't know. I shouldn't have sold it with the clam because now I don't know how much they're worth. But uh, I'll figure it out later. <laughs> Um, I think I'm probably wrapped up for this video. I'm gonna keep playing off-camera, of course, but... 
There's just not a whole lot of interesting stuff to look at at this point, I think. Um, because yeah, this is a slow-paced game. It does take days and days for things to happen. Um, yeah, I bought some stuff from Nook Shopping. Internet Surfer. That's right. Uh... Ooh. Um, yeah, I think I'll wrap it up for this video. Um, thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed. I hope I managed to think of stuff to do in this video to make it into to make it into. Um, I tried. Let me know. <laughs> um, next time. I'll probably be recording again tomorrow once the museum's actually up so that we have somewhere to put all these fish and bugs and I can catch more of them without having to worry too much. Um, and yeah, look forward to that. I'm guessing it's up tomorrow and my house will be up tomorrow as well, so I'll have more storage space. Um, but that's about it for the, this video anyway. Um, cool. Thanks for watching. Bye.